There are probably two reasons why somebody would be picked for an inquiry in the current climate. Um, one is because the revenue feel that there is some kind of risk associated with the information they've sent in on their tax return. And by that I mean something on the tax return doesn't stack up to what the revenue would expect to see from the sorts of results that somebody in their business normally makes. So the revenue have a wealth of information, statistics, um, historical data, which tells them what profit margins they expect to see in all sorts of businesses. For instance, what a florist in Twickenham might expect to make every year. So huge information, a huge bank of information. And if your tax return doesn't reflect what they expect to see, they can perceive there is a risk because you've perhaps understated your income or overstated your expenses. The second reason why you might be under inquiry is perhaps what we call third party information. And third party is basically somebody other than you that gives information to the tax man. So it could be a bank, it could be um, a letting agent, perhaps if you've got a property that you let, the letting agent has to give the amount of revenue certain information. Um, or it could be an individual, perhaps with a grudge, uh, there are various stories about how important the revenue see ex-employees and ex-spouses as a very reliable source of information. So at the moment I would say it's probably one of those two. It's unlikely to be a completely random inquiry these days because the revenue are much more business-like and much more focused on only looking at cases that they think will bring in money. Depending on what has triggered the investigation, you might get some kind of enlightenment as to why it's arisen as the inquiry progresses. There's nothing to stop you asking at the onset of the inquiry, but the revenue don't have to tell you, and in my experience often won't tell you. But as you get further into the life of the inquiry and you get a bit more uh, of a relationship going with the inspector that you're dealing with, you might find they're a bit more amenable to explaining. If it is something along like third party information, so the banks reported to the amount of revenue income that you haven't shown, they will usually advise you of that fairly early on. But any anything else, no, it might take some time to come to light.